All right, welcome back. Um, gonna do another eh, unboxing. What the heck? <clears throat> I say that because I don't do unboxings very often. Um, pretty rare. Um, at least based on again my old channel. <clears throat> my new channel. Uh, this makes my second unboxing. Um, so I'm at Walmart the other day, and I'm thinking, kind of like to pick up this van model kit. That's a '77 Ford. Um, I don't intend to paint it or even style it in this design. The Coca-Cola thing. That's I'm over that. I did I did the um, the massive Coca-Cola trailer with the uh, tractor trailer. Um, I think it was a. Felt like it might have been a Freightliner, Western Star. I forget now. Um, I'm over Coca-Cola in terms of model kits, but I I like the design. I, I always liked the, the the vans, and I have. Sp Special plans for this one. Um, I'm probably going to save the decals for my um, my trailer, uh, but I'm going to I'm going to paint this one differently. Um, I am a huge fan, huge fan. Been a big fan since 1991 when it first debuted on uh, public television, uh, the Red Green Show. Wonderful show. Very funny. Even to this day, it's hilarious. I own all his books. Um, C. Smith's books. I own the uh, box set they released of the entire 15 seasons of the show. Uh, I'll put some pictures up here so you can kind of get a, an idea of what I'm talking about. I know it's not probably a widely known show. Um, but I, I, I want to use this van as the possum van. I want to paint it up to look just like the, what you're probably seeing on the screen right now. Um, <clears throat> I don't think it's the same kind of van. I feel like the van that Red Green drove around in was the, uh, it was a Dodge van, but I'm not positive on that. I could be wrong. Um, but I, I feel like I could, I could make this look pretty good. Um, I mean, all it really takes is a paint job. Really, a van from that era is the same as every van from that era. They, the, the Dodges look just like the GMCs. GMCs just look just like the Fords. They all look the same. But he may have driven a Ford. I do not remember the specifics. Um, so I think I'm going to paint this one up to look like the red green van, the possum van. I, I think that's just going to be so cool. Um, so we'll, we'll open up the box. We'll take a look at what we got inside. Okay, so I got the plastic off the box. Um, while I was taking the plastic off the box, I did a little bit of uh, Googling did find that the red green possum van was in fact a Dodge Ram van um, so naturally this isn't going to be totally accurate to the show it'll even be a little bit too short really the, the possum van was uh, it had an extra extra two feet at least on the back end of it um, so but you know what I don't care I, I, I think I could really make this work so it's going to be pretty cool um, so we'll open up the box we'll take a look first we got the, of course we got all the coca-cola crap on the thing here uh, could paint it white. It's supposed to come with the bottles. I think it comes with a machine as well. And a dolly, but I'm not positive on that. Typical for AMT, they put all the... Instead of putting them on the instructions, they put the, the layout of the parts on the back of the box. Um, so we got the box here. This is really cool. Got the chrome... I feel like there wasn't a lot of chrome left on the possum van, so I'm probably gonna gonna scratch that up and paint it a bit. Um, got the windows and the marker lights. Got the little teeny tiny wheels with uh oh look at that, they even re red walled them. That's pretty cool. I don't know if it's showing up on camera or not. Uh, we got the van itself. So yeah, I, I believe this is gonna be a little bit short for the possum van feel like the possum man would be about that long, but, eh, you know, I, I'm not going for 100%, you know, um, accuracy here, we got the, uh, all the inside and the outside in one package, that's good, we got the engine, looks like the cab, cab box, oh no, that's the vending machine, so it does come with a vending machine, neat. And we got, looks like interior, more engine parts. Oh, oh, that's kind of cool. Look at that. That's the, um, 
That's the Coke bottles. Maybe I'll paint them up to look like beer. Beer bottles. That's what Red Green would have had in the back of his van anyway. <laughs> uh, and that's about it. We got the typical instructions. The decal sheet, which again, I don't care about because I'm not going to use it. Um, yeah, decal sheet. So yeah, that's my going to be my upcoming project. I don't know when exactly. I have a bunch of other projects on the table. <coughs> um, of course, the Black Pearl uh, wooden ship kit. That's the HLI build. Um, I might build this for an HLI kit as well. Uh, build, buddy um, group build because uh, they do have one for uh, land, air, and sea, which I... I I don't know if this will uh, apply or not, but I'm going to check. I might, might make this one as part of that build as well. I'm sure they'll appreciate the red green possum van. Um, so let me put all this away, and um, and we'll we'll bring this video to an end here. Okay, so um, yeah, so that's my plan. I'm going to take this Ford uh, van um, again, not going to be accurate in terms of the make and model uh, red green drove around in a dodge ram van um but i think i'm going to make it look pretty nice again i'll put up I'll, I'll have some pictures up throughout this video showing what i'm, I'm kind of going to go for um but i think that's going to be fun to do i think that's it and thanks for watching